Before we begin with some weather, check this out. The nation's first fully electric fire truck made a stop at the Minnesota State Capitol today. The truck is taking a statewide tour. It was built in Minnesota and it features both front and rear wheel steering. It can also be fully charged in about an hour. The truck carries a price tag of about $1.1 million. However, that is compared to the $800,000 for a comparable diesel powered truck. So it's not that much more than the yeah. diesel one. Something oddly uh, toy like looking about it though, right? <laughs> It looks yes, like a bus. Unusual. Yeah, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sure. I mean, that's the thing. I, I yeah, I'd be curious to to learn more about sort of its capabilities. It is cool that you is it I mean, how far is a fire truck even going? It's so funny when people get mad about like like I've seen this with uh, uh true. It's not police cars too. They're like, how are they going to do a 400 mile trip? You're like, what? it's a police car. Right. It's right. kind of <laughs> in a general area most <laughs> right. of the time. It's a perfect application yeah. for it. I don't I guess I, that's a weird one like how many how much um, our fire trucks on do they do they put out a lot of emissions like i think of it as something that usually just sits in the garage oh mm. that's a good question how much are they actually yeah doing? right like the more you use uh the vehicle the more it makes sense to go right. electric in theory well i mean you yeah. think about they go to they do inspections all yeah, day that's true. Not just most days calls. yeah right. they yeah and they respond to a lot of those like us when our fire yeah. alarm, the goes, alarm off. goes off oh man we haven't burnt the popcorn, popcorn here in a while which is good we got a really low wattage microwave that helped the situation, I think.